Hello everyone and welcome to Bath Garden Center. This week is our last houseplant pest series in our videos and we are going to talk about thrips. Thrips are common pests that you will often find in your garden or near your vegetables, but there are no exception to indoor plants as well and your house plants and also flowering plants like geraniums and roses. So thrips are very, very small, slender, dark brown bugs that will start sucking the sap from the leaves and also the buds of your plants and the stems. They are very hard to see, so you will often find the damage from thrips rather than finding thrips themselves. So with thrips, uh, they cause damage sometimes to the leaves and the stems of your plants and you can characterize that damage by a silvery patch that kind of starts forming. You can definitely see it on the leaves better, but the silvery, silvery patch will form and you will often see little black spots and that is just the waste that is uh, left behind by thrips. So how are we going to get rid of thrips? Uh, I would first start by cleaning up any debris or crops that are left in your garden. They will thrive in these areas and uh, it helps just to give your garden and even your indoor plants a nice refresh. So you will want to definitely look for thrips if you are leaving your plants outdoors on these nice days. That's why we clean up our gardens and clean up any debris because thrips can transfer from your garden to your indoor plants if you like to leave them outside. Our first part of treatment, we like to recommend Captain Jack's Dead Bug. It really is great for thrips because its active ingredient is spinosad. It is gonna help all stages of thrips and really uh, you'll use this to coat your plant but not coat it enough that your plant is dripping. Uh, so just make sure you are spraying the leaves and the stems and also uh, the buds of your plants. That's where thrips like to feed. Another great solution that we have here at Bath is the Safer End All Insect Killer. Uh, this is another one that is going to kill all stages of thrips, which is really great. And both uh, the Captain Jack's Dead Bug and the Safer brand here are uh, organic. So you can definitely use them indoors and outdoors on your plants. And lastly, we also have uh, insecticidal soap in many different brands here. With these options, you will want to treat every seven to 10 days or until you start seeing uh, no more damage to your plants or no more thrips uh, infesting your plants. And lastly, we just want to remember if you are bringing anything indoors from your garden or if you're bringing your, your indoor plants back in from outside, to check for pests and also just quarantine those plants uh, just to be safe. Another good thing you can do is also just pre-treat your plants. Pre-treating will give you a peace of mind and will uh, help you with knowing that any potential pests uh, are going to be stopped before they even start infesting any of your other plants. Thank you for watching this week's video. We hope to see you soon here at Bath Garden Center and we hope you have a great day. <laughs> uh, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, I got this, I got this. Okay. okay. Just start going. Um, okay, give me a good peace of mind. Oh, dang it, now I already forgot what we were gonna say. <laughs>